Good morning, friends. Uh, Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live on our Patreon channel. And uh, I am starting to put together the things for you on Planet X. Uh, I am going to try to get that all recorded tonight. But this information that I wanted to share with you, I think, is very important, very vital information that you need to be aware of. And I'm coming back and I've made a couple of videos um, public that were not public before over on my Stephen Benoon channel. Uh, this one here, Ra, is coming as one I just made public. A couple of others I've made public as well. Uh, and the reason I'm starting to do this too is because now this type of information is, is becoming very, very important for people to be aware of in light of the fact that um, the deception that is going on is going to be out of this world. Um, and not just deception, some things are going to be flat out real, but it is part of the great deception because you have to understand the great deception or the falling away that is going to be done uh, that is spoken of in Second Thessalonians is to get you to believe a narrative of the gospel of Jesus Christ that is not accurate to begin with. Um, this one, the reason why I'm kind of doing this video right here, though, is because I was given this article here just recently. Let me make sure it's blown up big enough for you to be able to read it here with me. Um, Charlie Ward presents the Pyramid Code, TLS, partially transcribed by CAT. TLS, if you remember, is the organization, um, I think it stands for the Light System, Jason uh, Shurka is one of the uh, main guys behind this group here, or, or, or the narrator, so to speak, there, speaking more and more about that. I did a video, maybe it was this one here. No, that's Roz coming. Let me just see. No, 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 no. Where is it at? Hmm. It's actually over here. It's gonna. This is a different video I'm going to be speaking on uh, later today. It'll be public video here. TLS, who are they? And I expose this group here for what for what it's hard to define who they really are, but I am seeing the connections now that are connecting that are unbelievable, uh, and especially in the arena. And I'll share with you guys. Uh, I can share that with you anyway. That the TLS group there they are connecting with the lead doctors that are part of the movement. I'll just say it that way, because here on Patreon, we can't really discuss it. In fact, I can't discuss that here with you on Patreon. Let me just kind of give you some visuals here. Uh, and I want to really, my hat's off to this guy here on uh, Mr. Red Peel. Uh, he did an amazing video here where he shows the connection of this guy right here, Jason. Uh, with the TLS organization. And what's interesting is who he ends up doing interviews with. Uh, and that's what I want you to be able to see. Uh, this guy is from Germany. I'm not going to mention it here. It'll be on, it'll be on uh, iConnectFX.com or later. David Ike. I uh, don't have so much of an issue with that there. But uh, what I do have an issue with, let me, let me just kind of, I'm going to mute the sound on it. Let me... Uh, because the thing is, I don't want us to be censored on what we're doing here right now. You'll be able to see this on iConnect, though. Um, and talking about the uh, divine knowledge, right? Okay, there, there, there's that, there comes that great deception, that falling away. Uh, and Mr. Red Peel is going to show you some of these, uh, some of the groups here. Uh, including uh, people like Tin Penny and uh, uh, artists, uh, uh, many, many of those that are in that movement, Northrop, etc. Uh, you're going to see pictures that he shows here where he's doing an interview with them. Kennedy, okay, there he is right there with Kennedy. Uh, that's called The Truth, is what it is, uh, with Robert Kennedy and Jason Sir. Uh, look at it, look at there, look at there. Mikovitz, interview with her. Uh, artist, like I mentioned to you already. You starting to catch the picture there? Friends, I'm telling you, we're talking about a deception like you haven't ever seen before. And the sad thing is, is that 
<clears throat> Everyone that he's been in interviews with, I already know. I know know myself. There, there was the other one I wanted you to see too. Global meditation. Look whose name is on there. Northrop. We're being duped in a major, major, major way, friends. Um, let me come back over here. The thing I wanted to share with you here on Patreon here, though, is the technology. And here they talk about, holy smokes, the technology is coming to us so stupendously amazing. They will feel miraculous. They will feel science fiction-y, even though this tech uh, has been here for perhaps thousands of years. Wow, what do you know? Thousands of years. Yeah, it has. Sure has. Uh, by the way, the fallen angels is where that technology comes from, in case anybody forgot. I'm going to show you that in a moment. To where uh, denied humanity by demons. Oh, oh, it's denied humanity by the demons. No, it's denied to you by the elite. Uh, but nonetheless, you're still... And, and I want to clarify, this is one of the reasons why I'm starting to do more biblical teachings as well. Their technology is minor compared to what you are capable of doing as a spirit-filled believer. Okay? You as a spirit-filled believer can go beyond their technology. Did you forget how Philip traveled in the Bible? Not just Philip, did you forget how Jesus could take and just disappear before them in the crowds and walk right through them? The reason Jesus died was because to fulfill the prophecy, there was a reason for him giving his life. Did you forget how I showed you in Jonah? Jonah makes a three-day trip and a one-day trip going to Nineveh. Jesus said, the works that I do, you will do also, and greater than this that you will do. Jesus walked on water. Jesus healed the sick, raised the dead, disappeared before people. And it goes on and on and on and on and on and on. That is greater than what their technology is. In this article, they're going to talk about uh, the underground trains that can go from uh, New York to, uh, uh, to, to England in 30 minutes. I told you about that already. How long ago did I... They're talking about they're revealing this... I've already told you about all this technology that we have. Uh, in fact, Elon Musk... This video here, Elon Musk, the coming fake news on technology. Eight months or a year ago, I told you about that. I just got a message from my uh, friend, uh, Engineer in FEMA, that said that uh, they're going to be able to, that they're revealing, I think as Mike from around the world revealed, that you'll be able to charge your cell phone without even plugging it into the wall. I don't know where that video is that I did it on, but if you remember, now, I think Mike was saying 5G technology. Now, 5G technology may be part of that. I don't say that it's not, but if you recall, I did a video about pyramid technology that the aliens uh, put here initially, the, or the fallen angels put here initially, that is actually the way to energize or to create electricity. But in order for that to happen, they have to terraform the earth. That's one thing they're not telling you about their great technology, what it does to the earth. But that technology is free electricity. Literally, and I shared this with you, you'll be driving down the road in an electric car and it'll charge automatically while you drive. On this video right here, I talk about how Elon Musk, it'll come out eventually. They haven't done it as of yet. They're going to say, though, that he can say he can travel at the speed of light now. He's... He's created a spaceship that can travel at the speed of light. Elon Musk was put into this position for that advanced technology being uh, delivered to the public. But in reality, he did not create any of it. Just like the battery systems and all these things here, this being mentioned in this, in this uh, article right here, Elon Musk is not going to be the guy. It's just he's being the guy to be allowed to be as if he did. Um... 
Let's look at some of the other things. Uh, med beds are here, for instance, healing everything and currently being used for the children of the first responders, but med beds will be made available for all. Underground trains that connect continents in minutes already exist. Sure they do. Like I said, I've told you about this for a couple of years now. Technology already exists to clean up the oceans and Earth's forests, air. Now, now granted, I haven't told you about all these things because I didn't know about all of the different technologies that they have, but the point is... Uh, let's see, replicators already exist to replicate anything you want, food, clothes, buildings, etc. Hovercraft, hover cars, and so much more. It's all here and now. No need to wait years for all 6,000 patents to be processed and tech to be built, although that will happen in time as well. But here is my two cents. I'm so excited about the tsunamis of abundance that have begun showering Earth her kingdoms and humanity will heal, 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 reveal the terrible debt burden, uh, relieve the, excuse me, relieve the terrible debt burden the humanity has been crushed under. It will free humanity to enjoy being alive. That, of course, and granted, we should be free from all of that. But how would you like to be able to travel the way Philip did, just by thought, and then you're there? You don't need the underground train and wait 30 minutes to get to the other side of Europe. You could be to Europe within a, a matter of a minute or two, by thought. I want to share with you, though, as part of that technology falling away, etc. cetera, um, because truly it is, as Second Thessalonians, and I actually have that up for another video here, let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come except there be come a falling away first, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. But he is going to oppose himself above all that is called God or that is worshipped, so that he, as God, sitteth in the temple of God, showing himself that he is God. Now, I think they're going to make a physical temple for him to sit in, or, as again, as I said, they could do that through technology. Satan is going to mimic God's real, as he always does. Now, I'm going to share with you, and, and this, please, do not, this is one of the writings that they claim John wrote. I don't know if he did or did not. It's the purpose for me to share this with you, this, this little bit of information, is because we do know in 1947, when they discovered these writings here, um, they're dated at you know, going back to third, second, second century, I believe, as far back as what they believed that they were initially written on these ones here. Look only to the aspect of historical documentation, okay? Don't look at it as biblical. I don't. I want you to look at it from historical side of things to see about this information, now watch what he says here. He sent his angels to the daughters of men that they might take some of them for themselves and raise offspring for their enjoyment. And at first they did not succeed. This is talking about during the days of Enoch. When they had no success, they gathered together again and they made a plan together. They created a counterfeit spirit who resembles the spirit who had descended so as to pollute the souls through it. They did what? They created a counterfeit spirit? This writing allegedly is written by John. And it's, the, of course, the date of the document that they had discovered is 1,800 years old. 1,900 years, I think. The angels changed themselves in their likeness into the likeness of their mates. That's how they were able to deceive them. See, they couldn't deceive them the first time and they just came to them. Filling them with the spirit of darkness, which they had mixed for them and with evil. They brought gold and silver, gift of copper and iron, metal and all kinds of things. They steered the people who followed them into great troubles by leading them astray with many deceptions. And they, the people, became old without having enjoyment. They died not having found truth and without knowing the God of truth. And thus the whole creation became enslaved forever from the foundation of the world until now. 
And they took women and begot children out of the darkness according to the likeness of their spirit. And they closed their hearts and they hardened themselves to the hardness of the counterfeit spirit until now. Now you remember as I showed you earlier, um, those with Jason in the video, and I and like I said, this is part of a different series altogether, but you see the different the main names. All these individuals, their little main names and stuff, and this man is with all of them. Isn't that weird? He's with every one of them. Even with Kennedy, who I was beginning to think was a decent man. But then again, I saw that connection to that C-H-A-B, as you know the rest, add to that, right? Uh, that organization there. So now I know just what type of reptilian agenda we're looking at here. Okay? And sadly enough, that's where we're headed at. That man right there, look, look at the influence and the power that he's got. And then when I showed you all those faces of those in the medical profession, you know, and then I tell you about this great deception that's going on, then you cannot help but wonder when we look at the case of my father-in-law. And by the way, those medical professionals that were going in and out of his room, it's written right on there, 21 mils peroxide, 3%. Right on his bag, and that's him laying right there in the bed. You know, not to mention texting the dose, not to mention the blood transfusion. There it is, right there. Doesn't have any professional label on it, does it? Hmm. But they were able to get the certain group there to falsify it as if it were. But we had the evidence, and they didn't know that we had that evidence. But you know what's interesting? You can't, you can't get anything done, even with all the proof. And then I wonder how and why that certain people are so protected. Why are they so protected? It's because they're part of this group that's going on, this TLS movement. And then look at, look at the who's behind, look who is doing the and, Truth with Robert F. Kennedy Jr. and Jason Shurka? Are you serious? A new age of enlightenment. Like I said, I exposed the organization myself in this video right here. And I didn't even, I just barely touched on it there in that one there. Friends, you need to get ready for it because it's coming. I mean, the, the amount of deception that we're about to deal with is unbelievable. Uh, this technology, though, keep in mind, the technology that's coming, sure it is. It's been here for, for millennia, M many, many millennia, that is. But I'm starting to see who all is getting involved in it, and that's why I know a new world order they're playing both sides of the aisle, and they're the ones setting it up. And everything that we think that looks good that's coming, and that they've made look like they're all the bad guys, the underdog. They're controlling both sides, and you don't even know it. All right, I'm just now, like I said, I'm barely getting into this, so I'm going to be doing some as best I can, by God's grace, major exposés on these. So be listening in. Stephen Benoon with Israeli News Live here on our Patreon.